All right, so this is my first piece I'm putting in for my side here, guys. Okay, now this whole joint was coped using this and a disc sander. Okay, first I find my angle, throw it on a disc sander and make it flat. Then I hold it up and I take this here and I put a nice little radius on it. Then I fit it down and I put a radius on this end and this end using this radius edge here. Works really well. You can see that I'm just a hair below my pin. So if I were to take <laughs> one handed again. So if I were to take and hold this up okay and I'm stringing all the way down here to my center okay now unfortunately I don't have an extra hand free but I can hold my angle finder up right on that string you can see I marked it okay I marked a little line there not that the line even matters because once I have this I can hold this on the end of the pipe or tubing and cut it once I know this is cut and, and, it, and the tubing is a little extra long, I can lay it down here and use this again. That gets me 90% of the way. Once I'm 90% of the way, okay, I can use this. Now what the heck, let's walk over here. Here's my disc sander. Uh, this is Craigslist. There's no reason not to own a disc sander. This is a 12 inch. It's homemade. Um, you can find them all day long for 50 bucks. They're always on Craigslist. This here, some guy made it and passed away. His wife sold all his stuff and I ended up with it. So, but I take my, and I, I just grind it all the way. I don't even use tin snips anymore. If, if I got to grind off a whole half inch, I just plow it right into there. This disc has landed, has lasted me two airplanes. So that's, that's the difference between a, you know, a quality piece of sandpaper and something you find at Home Depot, which is junk. So, I go, I plow right into it, and I know that I have my mark on my tubing from my paint marker or chalk marker or whatever you want to use, soapstone or whatnot. I grind right up to it. I'm 90% there. So that that's, that's how I do it. Um, so, now that this is laid in, and remember, this I this is plumb to here so I just just a matter of strapping it in this is just sitting here I'm gonna tack weld it tack weld it I'm gonna run my other tubing into here I'm gonna go up to the side run it up into here I'm gonna go on top put my top piece in then I'll have a nice bed to run my um, tubing going up to my wing so that's the progress report. That's what I'm working on.